Elder Bednar, in your quest for knowledge, how much time do you spend reading secular sources such as magazines, books, and newspapers compared to church materials and scriptures? Well, in my present responsibility, I do both all the time. I can't break it down into a percentage, but we have a responsibility to know what's taking place in the affairs of nations. We need to know what's taking place in the world economy and in economies in various countries, social trends and demographics. So I spend a fair amount of time reading materials that will keep me informed. Sometimes members of the church think, well, you know, they just kind of receive it, and therefore they know. The answer is you have to work really hard to try to obtain it, and you are assisted in that process. But it all goes back to that fundamental principle of being an agent who acts, not an object that is acted upon. So uh, the members of the Quorum of the Twelve, and especially the members of the First Presidency, don't just sit and wait for the things to be delivered. They are anxiously engaged in learning. And the, in terms of studying spiritual things, we have a, a really wonderful advantage in that that's all we do. All day, every day, our foremost responsibility is to bear witness of the name of Christ in all the world. And we can't do that unless we are consistently immersed in His Word and are coming to know Him better. So I didn't give you a percentage breakdown, but the real answer to your question is you have to ask and seek and knock and strive to obtain. That's essential for that to be able to work. 